Spencer Lee, as a recruit, was a once-in-a-decade type guy. But as a competitor, he's even separated himself even more from that once-in-a-decade. And it's not even generational. It's three generations. There's nobody that's more of a cold-blooded killer. There's the fall! There's the fall! Yeah! There it is! Spencer Lee is trying to accomplish something here at the University of Iowa that's never been done before, and that is becoming a four-time NCAA champion. This is the Big Ten. He makes a mockery he's of this sport. It's eagle. not that easy. He's handled adversity better than anyone I've ever seen. And then you deal with the emotional fallout that's inside of you, the doubts. That's what he's dealt with. I've been hurt every year for the last six years. 2017 high school, I tore my ACL, went to college, had surgery, retore it again in the 2019 NCAA Finals. To compete with the injury that he had is not common. I was at a point where I wasn't even wearing a knee pad or a brace or anything. Not even taped my knee in practice, feeling completely normal but everything kind of went down the hill when I uh, tore my left knee. He's able to get the far ankle and drive through and get a takedown. It's the first time he's ever taken me down. And I'm laying on the mat just going, wow, is my left knee blown out? I want to tell Terry like, hey, I tore my ACL. Like my left knee is blown out. And he like gets in my face and he goes, wake up. I was like, oh, okay, I'll wake up. You know, and I just forgot that I turned my ACL. It looks like a football score, but it is a tech fall for Spencer Lee, 21-3. They actually filmed my mouth move, and I go, I tore my ACL. And then Tom comes up to me, and he goes, you're good knee? I go, yes. He goes, all right. And next thing I know, two doctors are with me. We got back to a back room, and he's checking. And he goes, oh, yeah, it's torn. They're like, well, what do you want to do? And I'm like, I'm wrestling, what do you mean? And they're like, okay, let's wrestle. Tom didn't want anyone to know, because he didn't want to tell one person, then have word of mouth go out, and then they tell their dad, their dad tells another dad, and it just, you know, shoots everywhere, right? One of the announcers comes up to me and he says, hey, what's going on with Spencer? And I go, what do you mean? He goes, come on, he's not the same guy. I go, is it that obvious? And he goes, yeah. And I go, just wait. Spencer tries to reshoot on him, gets around on the side. Two takedown for Spencer Lee. Nice job, Spencer Lee. Spencer Lee is Iowa's seventh three-time national champ. Everything kind of came together and just like exploded out of me. And then they grabbed me to do an interview. Tom grabbed me, says, relax. He goes, but tell him. I'm like, tell him. He's like, tell him about your knees. And I'm like, okay. I mean, eight, eight days ago, I tore my ACL. In my other knee, I'm wrestling with no ACLs, and uh, you know, whatever, man. I didn't want to tell anyone. Uh, excuses are for wusses. And you know, he wasn't gonna make excuses. Excuses are for wusses. I'm gonna still go win the title, even if you amputate my leg. Last year was unique because I literally could not train. Imagine having a two-hour practice and you only wrestle for 35 minutes and for 20 of that you're warming up and you do that twice a week. Is that the way you should get ready for wrestling? I don't think so. I tried to compete in the 2022 season and I was unable to do so. It took me so long that I almost missed the window to get a medical red shirt. What it boiled down to was, do I want to wrestle and train like this for the rest of my career? or do I want to try and get surgery and try and be healthy for once in my life? I wanted to see what it would be like to wrestle healthy one time in my career. I ended up having surgery on both my knees in January of 2022, and now I'm here. He got all the information, gathered it, and was like, yeah, I can do that, I can, I can handle that. The goal of rehab is to like feel normal as soon as possible, and it's never going to be as soon as you want it to be. Of course his schedule is going to be 
a little different, but it's going to be designed to test him day to day, week to week. We'll take it as it comes. Let's see where he's at. Was he prepared to make a run for number four? That's the most important thing. And that's the fall. Spencer Lee down 8-1. How do you like that? Spencer is a guy that is constantly looking in the mirror. There's a fear that he might not quite measure up. And so when he steps out in the mat, his boiler's running because he's going to make doggone sure that the doubters are going to pay. If you doubt me, you're going to pay. The adversity has shown the world how tough he is at handling whatever is thrown at him. Spencer Lee with the fall, your number one wrestler in the country. That's what makes Spencer Lee the toughest man on the planet. It takes Spencer Lee all of 38 seconds to pin the number three wrestler in the country. What can this man not accomplish? Being a four-time national champ would be the first goal I've ever achieved. I want people to think that I'm human, because I am human, but when I'm on the mat, I like to think I'm not. 